The FIVB Volleyball World League is an international men's volleyball competition. Created in 1990, it is the longest and richest of all the international events organized by the FAR Copyright DAO Copyright Ration International de Volleyball. The tournament is annual. The women's version of the competition is called FIVB World Grand Prix. This event should not be confused with the other international volleyball competitions, the World Championship, the World Cup and the World Grand Champions Cup. History equals Origins equals The World League was created in 1990 as part of the intensive marketing program that would become a distinctive mark of the FIVB's activities near the end of the century. The idea was to promote the sport of volleyball by establishing an annual competition that would appeal to audiences all over the world. At that point, international competitions involving top volleyball teams took place only in four-year cycles, and were usually confined to a host city or nation. By contrast, the World League was designed to be played on a one-year basis, with a system of rotating cities that allowed every team to host a number of matches in the preliminary round. Further restrictions on participation, such as mandatory local broadcasting, ensured massive TV and media coverage. The FIVB's strategy eventually proved visionary. At the turn of the century, the World League was fully consolidated as a major international volleyball event. Generous rewards in cash, from 1990 to 2004, the total sum spent on prize money jumped from $1 million to $13 million compensated in the eyes of the national federations for the competition's relative lack of tradition and prestige. Following the success of the World League, the FIVB launched a sister project in 1993 for women's volleyball, the Grand Prix. It was very effective in East Asia, where this type of event has become tremendously popular, but its results in a worldwide scale still remain timid. Equals winners equals, in the 1990s, the Italians dominated the World League, winning the first three tournaments in 1990, 1991 and 1992. Playing at home, Brazil, at the time the Olympic champions, managed to take the gold in 1993, but Italy regained the title in 1994 and 1995. In 1996, foreshadowing what would happen just a couple of months later at the Atlanta Olympic Games, the Netherlands beat them in an extremely tight five-set match, before Italy once again won the gold in 1997. In 1998, the winner was Cuba, while in 1999 and 2000 Italy won again. As can be seen, Italy were clearly the dominant team in the first decade of the World League. From 1990 to 2000, the World League was played 11 times, and Italy took gold 8 times while the remaining three titles were won by three different teams. Italy's supremacy in the World League began to wane in 2001, when Brazil won a second gold medal, beating the Italians in three straight sets. With further titles each year from 2003 to 2007, and winning another titles in 2009 and 2010, the Brazilians were the preeminent at the start of the 21st century, being also world and Olympic champions. The interruptions to Brazil's dominance came in 2002, when Russia took the title, and in 2008, with the United States winning gold and gaining positive momentum going into the Beijing Olympics. Competition Formula The FIVB is constantly adapting the World League's competition formula to improve competitiveness and to make the games more attractive to the audience. Nevertheless, a few basic rules and restrictions will probably remain unchanged in the following years. Teams who participate must provide local media coverage and live TV broadcasting. The competition is divided in at least two phases, a preliminary round, with a system of rotating host cities, and one or more final rounds, with one or more host nations. In the preliminary round, teams are organized in pools. Each team plays a total of four matches against all other teams in its pool, two at home, two as visitors. Each pair of matches is played over a weekend. When all the matches of the preliminary round have been played, the top end teams in each pool qualify for the final round, S, and the remaining ones leave the competition. The value of N depends on the number of participating teams and the format that will be employed in the finals. Host Nation, S automatically qualify for the final round, S. 
the FIVB has tried various formats for the final round, S, top 6, top 4, quarter semi-finals. For some years now, the most commonly used is a mixed format, quarter-finalists are organized in two pools, and the top two teams in each pool play semi-finals and finals according to the Olympic format. In the preliminary round, a team is usually given the right to work with a list of 19 players, from which the coach builds the 14-player lineup included two liberos, if the team include only one libero in the roster, their max roster number is limited to 12, that will be employed in a particular weekend. For the final round, S, only 14 players included two liberos are allowed. Hosts Appearance Brazil and Italy are the only teams that participated in all editions of the World League. Russia's total includes appearances as Soviet Union and CIS. Serbia's total includes appearances as Yugoslavia and Serbia and Montenegro. Results Medals Summary MVP by edition See also FIVB World Grand Prix, FIVB Volleyball World Championship, FIVB Volleyball World Cup List of Indoor Volleyball World Title Winners, List of Indoor Volleyball World Medalists References External links <laughs>